Hey YouTube, today I'm going to show you how to create your own website from scratch using Notepad. I'm going to be using Notepad++, doesn't really matter which one you use. If you want Notepad++, so you don't have to go to all these websites, I'll put it in the description. Before you open up Notepad or whichever one, create a new folder called My Web Page and open that folder when you're done and create another folder called Images. And in that, put your background and put your logo for your websites or website. And um, after that, you want to open up Notepad. Before you do anything, click File, Save As, save it in your folder, and go to your web page, save it as index.html, and make sure it's set to all types. Once you do that, then you can get started. And just try to follow along with everything I do. HTML. Oh, wait. Now you want to do your header forward slash your header and uh do your title the title is for like whatever your website is dot com don't put two t's or it will not work um I tried that once and it didn't work and I had to find out that that was why uh get tech dot com now you can put the body of your website the body is the most important part inside that you don't have to do this part uh, make it say something like uh, welcome to my site and that if you want a bold italic or underline just put B for bold I for italics and U for underline and for H1 is for to have it really big I'm not gonna do the bold and all that and uh, if you want a different color just do font color equals quotations whatever color you want um, I'm gonna do it in blue like that now if you save it and then open up your thing it should say welcome to my site like that and it says gettech.com right there and if it doesn't say that and you're doing something wrong um, I'm gonna open this with Google Chrome instead um, there you go I put that on one side put that on the other side now if you want it in the center just click center do center like that and then center again and save it and refresh it there it's in the center now if you want like your own website I mean not your website your own videos put uh, the name of your videos and all that you're gonna need a table tag and inside the table tag you wanna put table row and inside the table row tag you want to put the table data column which is TD like that and now you wanna now you can put your uh, stuff in there like for this I'll put my most favorite videos and then after that you can go down and put the name of your videos like how to get infections that's my most famous video everybody should know that and um, another one like that and then for it to pop up you want to put the tag list item so it can know that it's a list of things and do that for however many names of your videos you put like that and you also want to put organized lists for if you first can put a number next to it if you don't want a number or just like a little bullet you can put UL instead of OL like that forward slash UL like that now if you save it and refresh it like that it'll have it say you don't want it black you can still put font color and all that I'm gonna do that right now font 
color equals red and this one can be orange I guess um, now if you save it and refresh it it's red and orange like that now if you want the actual videos in there you can go click on your table and go to YouTube and get the indemn code of the video youtube.com um youtube uh hold up sorry for this guys there we go and now type in the video um, I put how to get infections on MW2 so I'm going to take the MDM code that MDM code right there copy it now you want to paste it in the table and for the second one you can paste it in the table row column if you want um, right here my other one there we go now paste it in your table row and if you save it and refresh it it should pop up again see now you have that now if you want a link so if somebody clicks on it, it goes to a website or something you can just put so a h e r f equals the name of the website tube.com slash tech support eight and then put click here for more videos or something you can put whatever you want now save it and refresh it and you got two working links well not two but you have a working link right there now say you want now here's where it gets cool say you want um, to change your logo so at the top it'll say your logo and all that all you gotta do is go to body click space and you click uh, oh, don't click anything you just do image no, actually, not in the body. You go make your own image. IMG SRC equals quotations whatever the um where where your picture is and all that. So mine is in my images folder, and the name of it is logo dot gif now if you were to save that and refresh it it says it shows your logo at the top and this logo is in my pictures now if you want to change the background color to one of your pictures you just do bg color equals where it is images slash the name of it background dot jpeg now if you save that and refresh it um bg color background color uh they should have your background and all that now after that you can I guess have all your stuff here and everything you got the name of it and you got working videos 
and you got a working link okay uh, now see here's my folder and here's where my links were my logo and my background You can do the background color and all that. And well, that's all you do. Thanks for watching, YouTube.